Welcome back everybody. Sorry about the delays in videos, but I was putting together a couple of Airbnbs and so it's been taking up a lot of my time. And I've yeah, been hiding from Biden. But today, anyway, what we're gonna do is we're gonna shoot a steel door, okay? Now in the movie, sometimes they represent it properly in which a bullet can pass through a steel door. Sometimes they don't. But I'm gonna show you that a typical steel door can be shot through. And today we're gonna use a 22 LR a 22 Magnum and a nine millimeter. So let's get to it. All right, go ahead and show you the front of the door. See, there are no bullet holes anywhere in the front of the door. And the back of the door, you got a couple screws, but no bullet holes anywhere in the back of the door as well. Okay, so first up what I'm going to have for you is a 22 LR shot out of a 22 revolver uh, Harrington and Richardson model. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. All right, so we'll be shooting from about 10 yards away at that steel door. I'll show you where it hit real quick and then we'll go on to the next gun. There's the hit. And for the next shot, we'll be using a 22 Magnum shot out of a mini 22 revolver. Alrighty, mini 22 revolver, 10 yards. Let's go up, show you that one. There's your Mini 22 revolver. There's your 22 LR. All right, and last but not least, a nine millimeter shot out of a Glock 19. All right, nine millimeter. And that's just below where the 22 Magnum is. All right, let's go up and take a look. I was, I was securing the guns at the time, so. All right, let me flip the camera around. All right, so there we have our nine millimeter. We have our 22 Magnum and our 22 LR. Let's take a look at the back of the door. And our 22 Magnum should have come out right there it is. Uh, I'm sorry, that's the 22 LR. There's the 22 Magnum. And there's the nine millimeter. So typical steel doors, they're not extremely thick as far as the steel goes. I mean, probably less than an eighth of an inch in steel on a typical steel door that you'd find on a home. I'll show you the front of these again. That's the 22 LR. You can see right through any of the insulation and stuff that's on the inside. There's the 22 Magnum. And the nine millimeter. Also, okay, so some of you also may have been wondering, well, what kind of ammo was I using? Okay, uh, out of the 22 LR, it's just a typical lead round nose 22 LR box ammo, you know, just the cheapest stuff you can get. Uh, out of the nine millimeter, typical ball ammunition, again, like 115 grain, super cheap stuff. It's target ammo, it's nothing special. Uh, the 22 Magnum, those are 22 Magnum hollow points that were in that particular one. And that's it. I mean, just completely basic ammo, nothing special about that ammo in any way, shape or form. Okay, so the whole point of the video is just to show that, you know, doors are not gonna stop rounds. Even from a small 22 out of a handgun, it typically doesn't stop it. Even if it's a, a basic steel door, it's not really gonna stop that round. So if you see in the movies a lot of times where rounds don't go through doors, it's completely bogus. They will go through it unless it's a you know pretty thick steel door. Uh, but a typical steel door on a house, not gonna stop it. An interior wooden door, not gonna stop it. So if for some reason you ever find yourself in a gunfight, just being behind the door, isn't good enough. You have to get actual real cover to protect yourself. 
that's all I got for you today, guys. Thanks a lot for joining me. Take care. I'll see you next time.